So we going Marvels or we going Loki first? Uh, Marvels. You want to do Marvels first? No. Marvels. Do Marvels. Give me the Marvels. Tiana Parrish, come on the show. Appreciate you. Yo. She was filling out that costume, boy. That nigga is my type. <laughs> yo, she was filling out that cot. Yo, I don't want to. Space swear, suit? I, I don't. Nah. Is space? I was like, yo, is it just me? Nah. Mm-hmm. Is it just me? Mm-hmm. Nah, I was like, <laughs> <laughs> I was like, all right, dog. Baby. I was like, all right. This, Let me this talk not, to you. I'm not here to objectify you, but. Mm. She on my spectrum. Come mm. on. <laughs> Come on with it, baby. <laughs> what was he? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Oh, shit. So the Marvels. Yeah. Um, One of the most <laughs> lowly anticipated movies of the year when it comes to, Mar- when yeah, it comes to uh, MCU. Yeah. Uh-huh. I'm being honest. Niggas didn't anticipate this shit at all. Yeah. You know, whether it's because, you know, Marvel ain't been doing the best job with their films and shows, whether it be a cast of all women or whatever their reason might be. Or maybe they're, you know, they have the superhero fatigue. People weren't look, really looking forward to it. I was like, because my theater was empty. I don't know about y'all niggas. Yeah, it, it was. was. Mine yeah, was too Mine empty was fucking. As well, like, I could go there. Like, usually if I go there, like, you pre order the tickets, uh-huh. usually ain't no seats. I went there day of. Picked whatever seat I, I want. Yeah, mm-hmm. it was it was cool. Like no matter what time either, I was like, nah. I don't know if this is good or bad. Bad. Mm. It, um, I, it's bad in terms of I don't think there'll be a sequel. But well, this you know, is, as, yeah. as far as moving the story along, you know, it did its job. You know, it it did what it yeah. needed to do. Yeah, I think unfortunately, it seeming is this movie is probably gonna end up being a flop. Uh, seeming at least unless something change unless. Mm. When I went, it was empty as hell, yeah. um, and I saw some other people in the, put in the Discord. They were putting the times they went, and their, their theater was empty. No, there was no nobody brought tickets yeah. for the, for the time that they were picking. So, mm. if that's the the trend, I think unfortunately this movie might not end up making its money back, mm. which is unfortunate. Um, because I think the movie was good. It the movie, was the movie was good. It was good. The movie was fun. Yeah, like, fun. I'm, I'm, fun is always <laughs> it was fun. that shit is always a key word for. Eh. No, like, I'm not. I mean, well, for me personally, it was it was kind of and but the movie was like yeah. you know it had its comical shit, it yeah. had its you know fight scenes, it had its sequences, it had its monologue or whatever. Yeah, I'm not acting like it's the best movie that was ever movied and the best MCU movie. I just I refuse, and I think anybody who does, it, I think they're being like super hyperbolic to say that this is the worst Marvel movie that they've ever made. I don't agree. No, I that. don't agree with that. I no. don't think this is the worst Marvel movie ever made. It's not the best, but it's not the worst. The worst. Yeah. I, it's I personally, I think it's better than Love and Thunder. I think yeah. it's better yeah. than um um uh Doctor uh, Multiverse of oh, Madness. Yeah, yeah. I didn't really like yeah. Multiverse of Madness too much. Yeah. I didn't really like Multiverse of Madness. I didn't. I, I, I didn't. I don't like Sam Raimi's direct. I didn't. It didn't. It didn't click with me. I gotta watch it again. Yeah. I watch it again and again. And when you when you say this, it's like in it's relative terms. It's like yeah, yeah, I didn't yeah. like it. Doesn't necessarily mean it's it like bad, the yeah. worst thing ever. It's just mm-hmm. not necessarily my favorite thing. I I, I think this is better than Quantumania. Um, shit. So um, I, personally, um, this is and again, this yeah, is my yeah, personal yeah, yeah. shit. Like uh, I, you know, I, I don't go that far. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I, I don't no. think it's. I don't think it's worth. I, I think it's better than off of one watch. I'm not. Yeah, sure. it was. It was certain things that, like when we were talking about uh, the wacky sequel. Oh yeah, it was mm. some wacky shit up there. Yeah. That goddamn singing planet. I was like, what the fuck? Yeah, but that's on purpose. <laughs> yeah, I know. Like, you know what the comedy feels like? I finally, I finally got a got a got a ring on it. What it feels like? Uh, you remember them when movies used to make fun of movies? Yeah, uh-huh. that's what it feels like. You ever watch superhero movie? No, but I know what you're talking if about. If you that. watch superhero movie and you see the comedy they doing there, it's the same as that shit that Marvel's doing. They make fun of themselves too much. Mm. I don't know if I agree with that. Why not? I just don't know if it's the same as the superhero movie because that's it's, it's not that extra scary but, movie level like yeah, shit. Yeah. So it's, I don't know if it's I not agree that extra, with, but like, it's it's close to it. Yeah, it's almost like uh, I mean Domino Domino does stand up. It's like one of those comedians who says a joke, they get a chuckle, but they keep going. And it's like okay, yeah. it ain't funny anymore, nigga. Like, you gonna do a whole scene like this? All right, okay, all right. I'll yeah. just wait till it's over. I think that. For a long time, Marvel has been too serious, and they're trying to lighten it up a little bit. What, you got a splinter, nigga? Or right? something, yeah. I don't know. So I, I, I touched my finger or something, and it fucking hurt. And I'm like, what the fuck is going on? Um, um, yeah, I think Marvel has been serious for too long. Everything's been, you know, uh, very just action-packed, heart-pounding, just, you know, everybody's on the edge of their seat. I think they're trying to alleviate some of that with just, like, some more lighthearted stuff. I mean, we do have an R-rated show coming soon. You know, we do have certain shows that give us, like, you know, the blood, Gus Gore, the cursing and stuff like that. But, you know, this one was just more, it felt like a family-friendly film. I don't know if that was because of the women. They didn't want to go as hard as, you know, 
as as, as if this was like a a real team up uh, Avengers thing, mm-hmm. or maybe it was like you know. You got this teenage girl who her idol is Captain Marvel, and then they want to play off of that. They don't want to, you know, make her. They they don't want to serious her out too much and like lose what they could do with her in the future. Well, I don't know. No, I think this was a a, a Captain Marvel specific thing mm. because a lot of people's complaints in the first movie is that she's very very stoic and didn't smile and was super serious the entire movie. So this is she a... She was in the army, man. Well, no, she didn't have memories. And but whatever, but so mm. that so that is a direct response to to that criticism. And also so the the music so like could I have done without the fucking musical scene? Like the musical <laughs> s- segment in the in the movie absolutely. It's not like I don't it's, I'm not a musical person like in terms like movies. Yes, you are. No, like movies. Like <laughs> I don't like I don't watch musicals. Uh-huh. Like Sound of the Rain or whatever fuck type shit. I don't watch. Like, <laughs> or I, cats. I, cats type shit. Yeah, I, that's not my my jam so much. Um so you never I, watched Hamilton? No, I've never actually watched it. You don't know what you're missing. Yeah, but I mean, I'm, people said it's good, and I, and I'm, and again, I'm not saying I wouldn't watch it. But I'm just saying typically that's not my my your, your my go to. Yeah. So I could definitely absolutely do without it. But I also think part of that was to, in a way, tie in like without doing it, a, like a, without doing like a Bollywood number, mm. a way to like <laughs> throw some of that shit in there because it's like representation for like yeah. for 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 uh, Kamala, Miss Marvel with Kamala yeah. shit. So I think there's a way to do it in certain things. And it's also a way to give Brie Larson something to do that's different, that's a little fun and a little light and more airy than because she was super stoic in the first movie and then people were complaining a lot about that so like do i love that segment no is it my favorite no but do i think it's like the world's worst thing that they could have done in the world also no mm. i mean i don't want to say the movie had a lot of cringe moments but they had a lot of not so good moments like i didn't like when uh samuel L. jackson pointed at monica and was like black girl magic and she started flying <laughs> why not i didn't like that shit why it's funny <laughs> A throw, it was a throwaway I, line for like, like a throwaway it. joke. I didn't like it. And you know the director was black, right? <laughs> I know, but I didn't like it. <laughs> I, I, I didn't like, stop taking shit from the internet and trying to make it like fit in movie world. Like yeah, I think you, it was just like a throwaway, just like that. <laughs> that that, that wasn't that wasn't her Shazam. Like so, she fl- black girl magic. She just started just lifting her off. Well, she was already flying before. I know, but I don't. I didn't like it though. He's just trying to. Occur. I just, I just think people are taking that shit too seriously. And I think that's the problem. Like, like people are like looking for things to complain about this movie in a way that I don't think they would do with other movies. Like I, I don't. I'm again. I'm not saying that it's the the best line and it has to be in a movie. I just don't think it's. I personally don't feel like it's as horrible as a lot of people. Like I think people were like they're gonna shit on this movie regardless. Mm-hmm. Like they whatever whatever they did in this movie they're gonna shit on it unless it was like some super immaculate shit which I it was probably maybe nearly impossible for them to do um but yeah i don't know i liked it it was cool mm. like again not the greatest but i don't think it was even close to being the worst nah. like i think this is better than thor 2 mm. right oh yeah like yeah. Uh, i think it's better than eternals maybe i think it's probably better than that like i, I think there's a handful of movies that is better than and, eternals Gotta think about that. Yeah, it, I like the Turtles way better than this. I don't know about you. I don't know. I, I, I have to rewatch the Turtles, but anyway, but I'm just saying, there's other movies that this is better than, and I don't think this is the worst that is ever done. I really I, don't. I think the dynamic between all three characters is really fun. I think I think this is like yeah, really a fun, lighthearted thing. I think. Um, that, now there's, the, but there are legit. There are things to be legitimate to legitimately complain about about this movie and some of the things that it, it does or ties into absolutely like it's not above reproach like the, the villain i think the motivations for the villain were why were wasn't cool. she blue Is why wasn't she blue because they're not all blue yeah, 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 yeah. i don't know why i was thinking the same thing and i think maybe it's because it's um uh like a conglomeration of different type of races mm-hmm. to make the empire itself so mm-hmm. i don't think they're all always blue is that ronan's hammer uh it's L- a similar L- it's a it's a yeah yes yes and no i don't think it's his specific one but it is a thing that the they use. I forgot what it's called. Can Bungie sue? What the hammer? Nah, that's a fucking I'm, gravity I'm hammer. Sure the, <laughs> them niggas, you I'm hit sure. on the ground, them niggas flew back. That's a gravity <laughs> I'm hammer. Sure, dog. I'm sure the, that that the, the the comic book hammer predates. Um, Probably. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if it did that in the fucking comic book. It, it blew the like. All, the only thing it didn't do was the do. <laughs> the only thing it didn't do. Yeah. yeah, I don't know. Yeah, the, the the character motivation was cool. Yeah, uh, the whole like her her. 
planet is dying because yeah. of fucking Captain, Captain Marvel, Marvel destroyed the AI. So yeah. now the planet is out of resources. So they, she had to steal resources from, from other, other people. Po- yeah. Yeah. So like the motivations cool. there was cool. Yeah. Um, what else? Uh, I I do think this movie does, and I've seen a lot of people talk about it. It it does sort of, uh, and I guess this was supposed to come out before Secret Invasion, but it does shit all over Secret Invasion to a certain extent. <laughs> I like it better than that, yeah. What Secret Invasion? No, I like. Marvel's better than Secret Invasion. Yeah, 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 absolutely. Yeah. No, ab- yeah, no. Because Secret Invasion was garbage. Yeah. My point is, like, <laughs> in, in Secret Invasion, they was like, oh, we have no home for the scrolls, yada, yada. And yeah, then you go to the movie, on the fucking and these planet. niggas have a whole ass <laughs> planet. Yeah, what the fuck? So fucking, what was the... Asgard like yeah. it was nothing. Yeah, but again, I think um, the Marvels was supposed to come out before Secret Invasion came out, but because of COVID and all that kind of shit, mm-hmm. and things got pushed back. So I think that sort of... Mm-hmm. Yeah, so that makes it a little... It's weird. And also, uh, but again, I guess if this is supposed to come out before... I don't know. I don't know where that stands specifically, but it's like all oh, all this shit with Fury and his wife, and then yeah. hugging and kissing and going back to spaceship, and then they never mentioned her at all yeah. in this movie at all. Yeah. Zero zip zero. Right. So I, yeah, so I don't know if this is supposed to take place before that or whatever. But um, yeah, so that that kind of fucks that up. So that just <laughs> no, no, no. I'm like, what the fuck? Yeah, going it just on? shits all over yeah, Secret Invasion. Yeah, because you had Valkyrie come and then take them. To wherever yeah. they fuck was going, they had something going on, right? Yeah, Ooh, Valkyrie and Captain Marvel. Did, did, did it seem like they was like they had well, like, like was chemistry? Like they had like an ex relation? Like they, they was Maybe. definitely bumping boxes back in the day. <laughs> I mean, bumping the boxes. <laughs> they was bumping boxes. Like they, they, they seemed like they they had a little Find something. That little man in the canoe. They, they, <laughs> yeah, they, they, they looked. They, they, they was the, they had a little moment. They was putting their they foreheads together. So. I mean, Valkyrie for sure. I know she's probably you know one of them, but Captain Marvel. I don't know. She, she be in be? space. She you know she married an Asian man in yeah, space. She's bisexual. She probably out here. She tried sexual. Yeah. She try anything once. She out, she out here, man. Yeah. Universe, are you telling me you know you ain't got those urges on other planets? Yeah, so her and Valkyrie definitely was like... Might have been. Maybe something that they'll... Ex- Can you stop? Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> maybe it's something they'll explore. We gonna get demonetized. <laughs> <laughs> they don't know what that means. It's game time. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Did, did it seem like in certain parts there were scenes that Missing, were cut out? That, yes. Yeah, Especially in the like, very beginning. When they were like switching? When, when they first started like, switching. they get here that it, quick? Yeah, okay. It definitely, definitely seems like there was something. Something was missing. Jaw, yeah, like it's like we're missing a few information. Yeah, something Something is missing. It's like I feel like there should have been more scenes to wherever they are. But also I think, but that's also part yeah, of the Tiana people. Tiana Parrish, yeah. I mean, that's a fact. <laughs> uh, because um, <laughs> this movie is only. show. Like a <laughs> like an hour and forty five minutes is a it's a lot, it's a, it's a lot <laughs> yeah. shorter than most Marvel films, so I'm I'm sure that they they probably had to cut out a lot of shit. Yeah, to like make that the runtime. Was this the shortest Marvel? I don't know movie if it's the shortest in recent history. Recent history, probably. I think shorter. that came up. Uh, I think it's one of them. Yeah, I don't know if it is, but it's I don't know if it's the shortest, but it's definitely gonna be close to. Like this seemed like, especially at this point, it seemed like ninety minutes, like on the button type shit. Yeah, yeah, because most of these are like they're doing two hour. At least two, two and ten. Like they're, they're at this point, so like this one being like an hour, forty hour and a half, or whatever is like, yeah. I didn't like how homegirl uh just exploded herself at the end. She got the two bands went clink them again. They're like, yeah, yeah. She, <laughs> like, the power, yeah, over, the power she overwhelmed the power. She yeah, she, but it was like, damn, that's how you got rid of her. Okay, all right. Yeah, she should have just let her have the bands from the beginning. Like, it just, <laughs> I mean, they didn't know, know nigga. <laughs> I they know, know, but it was like they didn't know this fucking movie had been a half hour. Yeah, yeah but they didn't. They still didn't. The episode. They did, They still didn't explain why the band was on Earth to begin with. She used to say, "Oh, my my grandmother mailed it to me." Oh, well, now nah, they. I think they explained that in um Miss Marvel on uh, the show because you know they had to put it somewhere, but everybody thought it was on Earth. Nobody thought to check. Oh, it might be on another planet or like somewhere in outer space. I don't remember that. Yeah, I don't know if they explained how it got to. Yeah, Earth. No, they how it got there. They, I thought she. I thought the grandmother, like the grandmother, had one. No, yeah, before she, her, before her, I was the one I'm talking about. Like, who so put it there to begin because with? Because in the in Miss Marvel show, they found it on a Cree yeah. arm, blue arm. Mm-hmm. But if you remember, though, and did and, she give it to somebody else to take somewhere and say, "Yeah," this? but that's the same one that Kamala has. Huh? That's what I'm saying. So okay. there's <laughs> there were there's two bands. They were right. made at the same time. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So two arms. Yeah. Bands. Yeah. So oh, whatever. So somehow one got to Earth. But if you remember. It was also at a, at a like a temple with the ten rings symbol. Mm-hmm. So I yeah. think that there's going to be some type of connection with the ten rings, maybe, mm-hmm. and their space and time shit. So maybe that might explain why they're separated. But so they, the uh, her great grandmother's people 
found it, found a band. It was like, there's supposed to be another one, but there's only one. So then she grabbed it, mm-hmm. had it, used it, whatever. But then um, she died. She gave it to her, her husband, whatever. And that's the one Kamala ends up with. Mm-hmm. And, in the, and in Marvels, they find one buried on the planet. And she's like, there's supposed to be two, but there's only one. Stupid Somehow it got separated. We don't know why they got separated or how they got separated. How I think the fuck this, you not know where the other one at? Like that, that band well, name, you're like, mm-hmm. oh, ain't pulling you. Well, uh, I'm, I'm sure there's more story to that. I think that might be. <laughs> I think that might be tied into Shang Chi shit, and that might be some Shang Chi shit going on. With you know that. what I thought was gonna happen? Mm. I thought that when Kamala took the band off, whatever happens happens. I th- yeah, I thought just because she's a mutant, yeah. technically they mentioned that that she can use the powers without the shit. Mm. She she did. Did she? Mm-hmm. I didn't see that. There was a moment where she because when she took. Yeah, she did because she took the bands when she killed herself. The bands are floating in space, and she yeah. grabbed them with a big hand. Oh, she did. Yeah, yeah she, she did. grabbed yeah, them. Yeah, and she pulled yeah. them in. Why she, she put it back on? Because it's aesthetic, nigga. Because <laughs> <laughs> the drip. For the look, for the look, baby. Because of the drip, nigga. Yeah, like, why you put it back <laughs> on then? Like, you got get the drip, right? I don't nigga? know. Yeah. It's just like the drip, nigga. She gotta get the aesthetic, ache, nigga. I'm like, yo, bang, <laughs> bangled up, nigga. I guess so. <laughs> Which is also know. weird, though. I don't. Did anybody else notice though that at the end of the movie, when they're at, um, uh. Whatever. Spectrum's house or whatever the fuck. Yeah. And, the, the, the house and the yeah they're helping her move in and shit. Yeah. She oh, yeah. she's only wearing one bangle. Yeah. What happened to the other one? What happened to the other one? Is that just like a continuity, continuity issue, issue or is there some other shit going on? Maybe they shot that scene before they shot everything. Maybe because like, you know uh, reshoots and shit. Yeah, so they forgot to put both bangles on or yeah, some shit. Yeah. yeah. She, she didn't even show her mother. Did she show her mother that she had both of them? No, I don't think so. Look, Ma, I found another one. Look, Ma, Wonder Woman. Where was it? Oh, yeah, <laughs> space. Mm-hmm. I think that's a conflict of interest. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, <laughs> fair enough. I think mm-hmm. uh, I've, I've been feeling bad about thinking this all day. Mm. I think the mid credit scene was better than the entire movie. Well, I mean, the, the first time I was like, I'm surprised. Surprised. I was like, oh, I sat up. Yeah, <laughs> not even. No, that's, I was like, oh, that's, that's, that's that? the end credit. The mid credit is the fucking Young Avengers. Oh, that. <laughs> now nah, I'm not gonna lie to you. I was fucking with that. So I was like, oh, it's, it's finally happening. Then like she she acted like the Nick Fury but then the end credit one yeah nah yeah. I was like Kelsey oh, Grammer back I feel like nobody else knew what the fuck because I was the only one like oh shit yeah man. oh shit yeah yes Kelsey Grammer Ke- doing Kelsey the voice Grimmer of these yeah. and if you notice they had the they had, they had the Fox X background doors that they yeah. had like from the Fox movies right so it's like and he said Charles and then and then um I don't uh for, I forget. The, the mom I forgot her the, the actress's name off the top of my head right now yeah who is she she's playing binary. So I think so. Binary in the comic books, I think, is uh, a Captain Marvel like. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, no, she's Captain. Something happened with Captain Marvel, Carol, mm-hmm. where like I get like her powers like something happened like she like activating next level, and so she used to go around as Binary for a little bit of time. Mm-hmm. But now I guess yeah, it's gonna be was it Tiana Paris? Or th- no, Tiana Paris is mm-hmm. Spectrum. Spectrum. I can't remember what the the mom's name is right now. Fuck. Mm-hmm. But anyway, yeah. So she's Pull binary. Up. But if you, yeah. but if you also notice, she's wearing the quantum bands. Yeah. As binary. So again, yeah. so those still might tie in because I guess they're like help map space and shit. So I guess you could probably use them to enter uh, other dimensions and shit. Mm. But uh, yeah, no, I think the movie is good though. Yeah, the beast was a surprise. No, that was yeah. I was like, oh, yeah, shit. I was like, that was left there like a motherfucker. Yeah, I was like, whoa, hey. this is a little too early. Like, no, nah, it's <laughs> right on time. Gonna, I didn't think we're gonna see this motherfucker until like a, another five years. No, nah, it's right on time. They they starting to sprinkle the seeds. Yeah, because yeah. I didn't think that they were gonna be in Secret Wars. I didn't think they were gonna make the movie in time. Well, I don't for them to be in production. Well, something. they have to be at this point because you you heard um. It depends on what you do. What though. I'm saying is. You heard this thing of what they're gonna do? They're gonna have Fantastic Four in another universe too. Uh, yeah, I saw, they're gonna have all these. I think you saw uh, you posted on maybe Twitter or something. That's where I saw. Yeah, that. they're gonna yeah. have all them in a different universe, then come together yeah. during Secret Wars. So yeah, but I, so here's the thing: is it depends on what what their their plan is, right? Um, because I mean, you talked about it. I think last week or whatever. How in Deadpool three. The TVA, yeah, the TVA is like pulling heroes from dying planets and what or universes and whatnot. So they might not have to do like their own separate um, uh, X Men movie first they, mm-hmm. before they put them in Secret Wars. They might just be like, "Oh, here's a universe X Men." They show up, you know, you got the Fox shows, the Fox movies, and they do it like that. Yeah. So that's what I was saying. I don't know if they're gonna do like a X Men movie, but they've been fucking 
laying the, the, the little seeds down for everything. And and I'll say this. I think this is the first time in a, in a, in a long time where I have a small idea of where things are going. And mm-hmm. like the, the, it's like things are, I guess, finally starting to come together yeah, to a certain extent. Or at least it feels like that after this movie. Yeah, it's because... Like we talked about this so many times. It's like before they had so many plot lines mm-hmm. that was going nowhere, but yeah. the main focus was always the multiverse, but they kept straying away from it and doing something else. Yeah. Uh the multiverse of madness, it, it was okay, but it's kinda like eh, the movie wasn't that good. The movie wasn't that good <laughs> and it didn't really introduce it, 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 I guess it introduced the concept of incursions and it yeah. obviously showed you alternate version of characters and shows you fantastic like all the shit that can be coming but isn't, isn't here yet so fantastic for x-men because you got professor yeah. x and they all that kind of shit and then and then the the the, post, the other post credit scene what was it it was just uh charlie Theron shows up he grows the eye on his forehead mm. he screams it ends and it's like okay that's weird <laughs> and then the next scene yeah. and then there's another scene and it's just charlie Theron showing up and it's like oh incursions happening come with me and then we leave it's like oh, well what yeah it's like this is weird yo it's like these don't tie together and it's yeah. like and then nothing and so it's like alright but now it's like oh shit uh, Kamala's like Kate Bishop from the show was like hey I'm forming an Avengers team <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> it's like I don't want you to join <laughs> and did you know that Ant-Man's daughter has powers or whatever she, or, or Ant-Man has yeah, a daughter yeah. and it's like I right. and it's like these are all the things where we've been watching all these shows and they've been introducing these characters that we know as the young Avengers or characters who could be the young Avengers but haven't been doing anything with it and then mm. now all of a sudden it's like okay now we're gonna see where this could possibly go so it's like we got Kate Bishop Kamala mm-hmm. and I guess they're gonna get Cassie Lang and then I guess they'll probably try to get um, Young Loki I mean I don't, know, I don't know Kid Loki maybe if, I don't know where he is right now <laughs> but it's possible and then what's a uh, uh, Patriot I forgot uh, oh, yeah. Isaiah, Isaiah Bradley his grandson or whatever mm-hmm. Because they showed he was in Falcon. Oh, yeah. And I guess Scar, if you want to. Scar. I mean, he so he did show up at the end of She-Hulk, but I was like, uh, I guess. It's like, this is weird. Yeah, that yeah, fixed his haircut, dog. He's so stupid. That. Yeah, I know. Uh, <laughs> but I guess they could throw him in there, too, if they wanted who to. Who the fuck is the mom? Well, I don't know. In 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 this, I don't have no idea. In the, in the comic books, it was different. So I have no idea. Uh, then uh, X-Men, man. I can't wait. So I can... Yeah, I forgot who said it, but there was a producer or director said the uh, X Men is coming pretty soon or very soon or like oh, some some variation of soon. I'm paraphrasing, but I guess uh, we won't have to. Well, we might have to wait till 2025, but at least at yeah. least um, mm-hmm. since Deadpool's the only Marvel movie dropping next year. Mm-hmm. Yeah, well, that's what they probably said. see in that, huh? You probably see X Men in that. Oh yeah, absolutely, oh, yeah. absolutely. Yeah, you'd have. To, I would. I would absolutely imagine, but not the yeah. way we want. With like a, a full story. Oh no, no, no. Yeah, but nah, nah, nah. um. So yeah, um. I guess one out of ten. What do we rate the movie? Are y'all done? Yeah, 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 yeah. For the most part. Uh, I mean, listen, ch- check it out. I think it's worth watching. I don't think it's the world's worst movie that's ever movie. Yeah, it was just a singing part. I was like, okay. Yeah, I could definitely have done. I could have absolutely have done without that. I yeah. enjoyed that. Part. It was. Just, it was, it was fine. <laughs> like it was fine. Like I, I'm not like disgusted. Yeah. Yeah. They, like was, some people are acting like, oh, this is. I'm like, I thought like, it was funny. It was it's like, like yeah. if you don't say they don't understand. You. Yeah. Like, that's, that's kind of funny. <laughs> oh, he speaks. He can speak real. Oh, he's bilingual. Yeah, <laughs> I was like, he's yeah, bilingual. Yeah. yeah. I was like, I, so like again, I difference. No, Leroy. But like. Again, I could have done, definitely done without it. Mm-hmm. I'm not acting like, yo, no, this got to stay in the movie. No, it's like it just reminds me of Rick and Morty, like yeah. some Rick and Morty kind. Some shit would happen. Yeah, just some weird random in space. And also, it's like, oh, they're in space visiting all these different <laughs> worlds and cultures. <laughs> oh, here's a culture that you ran into that's just completely different from something that you know. And it's like, all right, like this is how they communicate. Water and you a princess? Yeah, she a Disney princess. <laughs> yeah, officially yeah. now. Yeah, kind of. Yeah. She officially Disney princess. How did Captain Marvel? Um. One out of ten. How many stars do you give this? Uh, How many marbles do you give this? Uh, it's probably about seven and a half. I'd say maybe eight, but seven and a half. You as fuck. Yeah. I, I, again, I like. I said I like the movie. I liked it. Okay. Bobby, mm. what about you? I gotta remember what I gave the first Captain Marvel. I can't remember. I give it a seven. I give it a seven. It was just certain parts where I was like, eh, okay, I get it. Like uh, when uh. Uh, Goose, when Goose had laid the eggs and they used the cast. <laughs> oh, yeah. I like that. That shit was fun. That shit was cool. I, I know, but it's like, it uh, oh, okay, so now all right. Goose is asexual. 
So I, yeah, I guess yeah, unless, unless she was getting apparently. spaced yeah. out in space. She was, she was with Cat Marvel. <laughs> she, she was Cat Marvel in space for a little bit. You don't yeah. know what she was doing before she got back to Earth, man. I don't know. She don't know what, what they were goose, uh, goose was goosing. And goose is a, <laughs> goose a is girl. Goosing. I don't know. Goose are, are flirking. Mm. <laughs> I don't know what it is. Flirking, Mortgage flirking, board. Flirting. <laughs> All right. She got pregnant by the sun. They was out in space. <laughs> <laughs> Remember when she did the, when she jumped off the ship and put it on the shoulder and shit? Oh, yeah. yeah. Little sunbeams could have pregnated her. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> you don't um, know how floor gets reproduced. I give this like a 6.7. <laughs> ah, damn, dude. Damn. You hated this shit. <laughs> no, I didn't. <laughs> it just wasn't. Uh, your favorite. Yeah, I didn't yeah. fuck with yeah. you. Yeah. fucking with you. Tiana Parrish, I love you. <laughs> Nine. <laughs> Nine. <laughs> yeah. yeah. 9.95. <laughs> yeah. 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 Um, it's like how you ass fat the space suit. Nigga. Yeah, oh yeah, another thing. When you, when you got God giving gifts from God, nigga. Jesus. Yeah, another thing before we move on. Uh, I did find it conveniently easy that she just went through the sun and just activated that shit. <laughs> After saying, I don't know how to do it. Okay, she, she powerful. Nigga. At some point, I thought she was gonna like <laughs> sacrifice. Yeah, sacrifice herself. Like you could have did that this whole time. <laughs> She could have did this whole time, yeah, yeah. but she didn't. Know. It's like a black girl yeah. to tell you, like, hey, you know you have that power, right? right? You, can, I don't you know can't activate can do this it. shit. Sometimes you just know. need a black woman to tell you how to live your life right. Black girl magic. <laughs> See, yeah. there you go. And, um, but you had this power. All you got to do is run she, through the bitch. But she's white, so you know. Yeah. She, you did all this searching through all these other planets. You fucked up their AI, didn't know how to turn the sun back on after you turned it off? Nah. <laughs> Dumb bitch. <laughs> she, yeah. even, she even looked. She, she didn't even try. <laughs> It took 30 years later. Yeah. She didn't even try. Because that happened, that's the other thing. That, that happened after the end of the fucking first movie, no, which was in like 1990. Tried, this movie would have been 20 minutes. This would have yeah. been a movie. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> they would have still had an atmosphere, nigga. Yeah. Everybody would still be alive. <laughs> Man, we need all this. Yeah, it, it is It is kind of crazy how they kind of have to nerf Captain Marvel now. It does feel like, they, yeah. They nerfed she, she, well, well, some of it was on purpose because uh-huh. if you notice when they was fighting, she was about to use her powers. Yeah, and then like, because she didn't want to switch, so she didn't use yeah. like the full. Yeah, bro. But yeah, she definitely did seem weaker than she normal. She used a strong hand. Yeah, yeah. She did not <laughs> use a strong hand. She hand. definitely, definitely was coming off weak. But that's the that's the the problem you run into with these super strong ass characters. Either yeah. they're too, either they're so strong they can just handle everything in five minutes, or. Mm-hmm. It, they're not now. Yeah. <laughs> it's like it's a, they're only strong when we need them to be strong, and then next thing you know, they're not as strong. I just think it was a way to regulate that, and then, like just just powering the sun, like it could have took something from you. Maybe it did. I don't know yet. Nah, she know. seemed she seemed pretty regular. When she was on yeah, her. Yeah, it's like damn, like you fucking overheated or something. Some passed out, died. She ran through a dead star, my nigga. That's yeah. crazy. Yeah, was, that much. shit almost killed through her. Like she's old people, she's not OP. Like she's doing it for. They, they, it's like they're they're nerfing her for convenience, which that's, is that's why she's strong, man. Like, <laughs> she was she was going through ships and shit in yeah. fucking end game. Like yeah. she's, she's strong as fuck. I was like, yo, you didn't know that you could do that. Yeah, nah, it's nigga, like, come on, man. The fuck out of here. Took her punch from the power stone, my nigga. She <laughs> didn't want to know. That's the problem. She's like, fuck them niggas. They they could die. Yeah, fuck your AI. <laughs> they wipe my memory. I don't give a fuck about none of them niggas. And, like, <laughs> and then she's like, oh damn, that was a little fucked up. Let that was a little fucked up. Let me go. Let me go reheat they son up. Yeah. Let me Put their son in the microwave. Mad years. <laughs> was just in the dark for mad long. Just, yeah, just one little goo. Let me rub, rub two sticks together. Yeah. Get this, they son started again. Mm. <sighs> oh man. So yeah. Um, Captain <coughs> Marvel. Go see it. It'll probably be on streaming like next week. Be- Damn. I'm if if, <laughs> if if this movie does as bad as it it's seemed like to do, yeah. before Christmas. Nigga. Yeah. Nah. Absolutely. I was, gonna say, before I, Christmas. I was gonna say the New Year. I'll say before Christmas. Nigga, yeah. For real. And again, and that's not a a slight because I like the movie. I just. If no one's watching it, yeah, that's what happened. Christmas specials coming out for Marvel this year or no? Uh, no none that I, I I'm aware nothing. of. Of none, obviously the actor writer strike probably. If there were even yeah. plans to do it, yeah. I'm sure that fucked it up. Yeah. So. Imagine getting Echo for Christmas. That's crazy. Oh, no, yeah. we are getting Echo yeah, for we are. Christmas, yeah, but it's not, yeah. a, what, what, not what, Christmas what, Day, but in what, a, it's, know, not but a, it, it's not a Christmas. I remember. Movie I mean, show. you know, we had Guardians of the Galaxy that was like Christmas based. Then yeah. we had Hawkeye. Hawkeye, which was that was like Christmas centric yeah. based or whatever. But imagine just getting Echo just beating murdering shit niggas out, to like, death, death them, <laughs> dashing through the snow and it's just Echo <laughs> dashing through your nose. 